Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. We are playing some more Starfield on PC through Xbox Game Pass. We just finished a quest for him, well, not fully finished it, but we partially finished it. What is... Really? So now we need to come back down here. I love the no gravity. It is so fun. Oh my god, can I get up there? Ah, oh, I fell. Whatever, it is what it is. I wonder what's taking Hank's. I hope I didn't make a mistake by letting Hank go. I saw. <laughs> Good work. See? I knew having someone on the inside like that would work out. I've already put it in order for the equipment. I was going to ask you to pick it up for me, but there's a problem. One of my guys, Hank Ferraro, offered to go. I tried to tell him he'd be more useful sticking to his job here, but he insisted, and he was already on his way out before I could stop him. But it shouldn't be taking this long. Just a quick trip to Gagarin and back. I'm concerned. Use some help with this. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe he got hit by pirates. Maybe he's out of fuel, drifting. Maybe he just stopped for chunks. Anyway, something's up, and it doesn't seem good. Since you've proven yourself so skilled in so many ways, I was hoping to call on you for it. So, you in? Yeah, why not? Oh, thanks. This is a huge help. You'll be happy to know I actually carved out some of the budget so I can pay you for all of your assistance. We don't currently have much information to go on. I'd suggest checking with Sidonia ship services over at the starport first. They'd be the last <coughs> person I know that's seen Hank. It's all I've got without sending you all the way to Gagarin to retrace his steps. Okay. Good luck. Gagarin, huh? I wonder where Gagarin is. Oh, these are all level one, really. Wow. Huh. Alright, so we need. I thought you were Vasco for a moment, but you're not. Okay. My okay. Whatever. Nice to kick back into broken spear after a long day. <coughs> Up here. Thought he was moving. Cool, whatever then. Alright, talk to this guy. You should inspect anything I can help you with? Hmm. Let's see here. Hank. Hank. Known by that name. Oh, wait. Here we go. Henry for all. Hank's gotta be his nickname. <laughs> Yeah, he's been through here. Took a ship and departed. Actually, it looks like he came back into Mars space recently. But he didn't land here at the spaceport. The ship diverted and landed outside the city a ways. Nothing out of the ordinary. Got a ship and left. Tried and failed to get a discount on fueling up. That's about it. 
I've been doing this job for years, and I can't think of many reasons someone would come in for landing, but divert somewhere else. I've seen people try to offload some sort of contraband that way, but usually they don't do a flyby of the port before doing so. And scans would have picked it up, so I don't know. You're gonna have to ask me yourself, if you manage to track him down, that is. Yeah, something seems off about this. You're probably right that you need to work this out with your boss. Maybe some wires got crossed. Anyway, good luck and good day to you. Thank you very much. I don't need that popping up, but whatever. But I got some free Xbox points for playing a game on an Xbox Game Pass. Bonus. Thanks, Xbox. <clears throat> While we're here, we should definitely stock up on supplies at the exchange. I have my supplies. <clears throat> Face on Mars, huh? Oh, it's lore. 1976, the Viking 1 orbiter took its first photographs of the Sidonia region. Among them was an image of what appeared to be a humanoid face on Mars. The image inspired the imaginations of millions cementing humanity's passion for space exploration and once again begging the question are we alone out there i wonder if that's true or not later photography would reveal that the face was no more than a mountain shadow and perhaps humanity's greatest case case of i am not even going to try to pronounce that but i think it's Pareidolia, a tendency to perceive specific meaningful imagery in an otherwise ambiguous or random visual pattern. Nevertheless, the legend of the face on Mars remains an important inspiration for many to this day. So is that an actual thing? Hold on, I wonder. Let's find out. Or is it made up? I'm curious. If it's real, that's cool. Um, uh, come on now. Phone load, please. Face on. Face on Mars. Apparently, it's a thing. Yeah, I know. It's a thing. It's a real thing. Cool. I mean, the game does use data from NASA, which I think is amazing. So, the fact that they have that in there, I wonder what else is in the game from NASA. That's awesome. has recovered a significant amount of data stolen from Galvin. Fudge it again! Dang it! Oh well. I wanna go up there and see what's up there. I'm curious, because you just never know. There could be a hidden box up there for all I know. I wonder what's I hope I didn't make a mistake by letting Hank go. That's a little suspicious. Why would he do that? Moreover, why wouldn't he return with the goods? Something's definitely up. I asked around while you were gone. Some of his co-workers mentioned he's been a little extra, well, Hank lately. In particular, he was cursing up a storm about work and about his co-workers. Said some things that make me think his intentions here were not pure. Anyway, he's not too bright. Maybe he's still here in Sidonia. Check the broken spear. He frequently goes there to drink. We need to get to the bottom of this. Well, see if you can get him to admit it first. 
And if he does, see if you can get it back from him. If he resists, or otherwise won't tell you what we need to know, then we may have to turn him in. I trust that Sidonia Security will bust him good, but he may not tell him where our stuff is. So see if you can at least get that out of him first. Hey, I'm not going to tell you how to do your job. I will say that I won't officially tell you to do anything to him. But he's been surly as of late and always had a weird chip on his shoulder. So if it comes to that, you do what you need to do to protect yourself. Hmm. I don't know. Hank's kind of a weird guy. He never fit in with the team. Tended to act a little sketchy. Always figured he'd be done after one contract. Guy like Hank? Maybe he's just looking to sell it on the black market and earn an extra paycheck. Can't say for sure. Remember, it's most important that we find out where the equipment is. We can always deal with Hank later. We've got to do it before we lose track of it, before it gets sold, moved, or worse. And we've got to hope to whatever higher power you believe in that it wasn't jettisoned into space. We've got our work cut out for us. Good luck. All right. <coughs> <laughs> so now we gotta go to the bar. Well, here he is. This is only my first contract, but I've already hauled more ore than any of the old timers could ever produce. That's rather jealous of me. Questions, huh? Let me buy you a beer first. Suit yourself? Uh, anyway, I seen you talking to Trevor. What's someone like you doing sticking your nose where it doesn't belong? You're right. I didn't want to bring it back, so I took it. I had to. Those guys all think I'm some kind of joke. And I'm stuck with this stupid three-year contract. I can't afford to break it. So, screw Deimos. Screw Trevor and all the other miners. Losing that equipment's the last draw for them. Did he tell you that? One last failure in a string of failures to meet quotas. It'll be layoffs for everyone, and I won't owe Deimos a damn credit. Mm. How could you? <coughs> you do it too if your co-workers never took you seriously. I'm always showing them how much better I am than them. And all they do is laugh and talk behind my back. They think I don't hear them, but I do. They say I'm a show-off, that I'm not good at what I do. So screw them. This whole planet sucks. Everyone here is a friggin' loser. No. Maybe. I don't know. You know what? Who cares? It's my plan, and I'm already doing it. Shit. You're right. Fine. You got me. You say I take you to the goods and we bring it back. You can even say you found it. Just don't turn me in, all right? Relax, Hotcha. I ain't gonna shoot you in the back. If that's what you're worried about, just, uh, follow me. We're going outside. If it's any consolation, I don't trust this man either. I'll keep an eye on him. Unless you're a Deimos employee, I can't really help you. I've warmed up to Mars since I came here. Uh -huh. Got my gun out for a reason. I don't trust this lunatic. You better not be lying about what you said back at the bar. Oh, I'm not. 
This gun is trained right at your head, buddy. Oh, gross. It's the same. <clears throat> really? I pressed the button for it, but I didn't do it. Weird. Where is he taking us? <clears throat> Man, I'm impressed you figured it all out on your own. I thought I was being so careful. It was so easy, right? The boss man forever so loud sometimes, you know? And I got good hearing, so I overheard you all talking about this equipment. I knew what it meant to everyone and how screwed it all be without it. And then Trevor just let me go pick it up because he thought I was showing you initiative. <laughs> It really was uh, the perfect plan. Hmm. That's what you think. <laughs> uh, I suspect he's walking us into a trap, so that's why I got my gun out. But the question is how far do we have to walk? And there's no button to, is there, hold on, I'm curious, is there a button to wait? Quick container, outpost, terminal. You know, there's no actual button to wait anywhere. <clears throat> so that's a good thing, honestly. They got rid of that. That's good. <clears throat> you know, it's too bad. I bet I could have made bank on selling this stuff. What do you think? 500 grand? Mill maybe, but where would I even have sold it? Not like I would have been able to march pallets of mining equipment down to Jane's without anyone noticing. Probably best for returning it, because what a nightmare that would have been trying to offload it. And trying to destroy it all would have been another huge pain in the ass. It's mostly metal, right? <laughs> Was I thinking? I guess I could have flown somewhere remote and buried it, dump it all in one of the old mines and forget about it. Huh, but then you would have been real screwed, huh? Good thing you found me before I did that. Am I right? Mm hmm. <clears throat> okay, I think I see a ship right there. You know what? I'm curious. Almost there, all right. I had to park my ship off away so they wouldn't find it right away. <laughs> I'm sure you get it. it. Seemed like a good idea at the time. Didn't think I'd be going all the way back so soon. At least you won't have to walk all the way back. Eh? 
I mean, you know, maybe we'll take the ship back to port and let someone else unload it, save ourselves the hassle of hauling it all back ourselves. Anyway, uh, see it just up ahead? <coughs> yeah, I see it. I don't see any guys around. Why is it scanning her? She's nowhere near me. Oh, do I have to actually... I do, okay. <clears throat> Alright, that's enough. Now face me, so I don't have to shoot you in the back. <clears throat> Alright. No. We got a problem we can't resolve. Namely, you know too much. Uh, either you're lying, or it seems to have worked out for you so far. Can't be that bad. Well, when you say it like that, maybe you got a point. Not if I convince them you were behind it the whole time, newcomer. And after I kill you, I look like a hero. Sorry, but I gotta do this my way. <coughs> and that means you need to die. Fair enough. <sighs> Might as well take what we can do. Oh, now we go back there? Well, I want to board his ship and take what I can and maybe take his ship because you just never know. <coughs> but what if I do? Oh, inaccessible? Really? Ah, uh, well, I tried, I guess. Hmm. Well, I tried, but it is what it is. Not a big deal though, who cares? I love how the NPCs just randomly pop up any, anywhere you are. I love it. 
Oh, they didn't put anything hidden up here. Are you serious? Come on, devs. This would be a grand spot for something hidden. Oh, man. Why, devs? It would be a grand spot for stuff to hide at. Really, devs? You didn't put anything up here at all. Really now? Really now? No hiding stuff, like no tr no chest or nothing up here. Seriously? Well, isn't that just a shame? That would have been the perfect spot for a, a chest or something. Come on now. Man, that sucks. Any luck? I'm looking forward to hearing all about this. <coughs> oh, do tell. What took him so long? Well, I can assume how that went from the fact that you're here and he's not. He worked hard, but he was a dumb kid. I just never thought he'd be that stupid or dangerous. It's a real shame. I'm glad you managed to resolve it and get back our equipment. I'll take it from here. You really saved our asses. I'm not sure how I would have explained to the suits that we lost all that new stuff. Thanks. If you're still looking to help us out, maybe 50 iron added. Rough go as Dude. If you're still looking to help us out, maybe check with Rivka. She seems to be having a rough go as of late. Well, that's the idea, anyway. Now, if we fail to meet our quotas, it'll be our own fault. Not the bloody machines failing to do their job. Shame we didn't have enough left over to fix old Gnome over there. Would have been nice to have another functional robot around. It's fine, anyway. I think we've gotten used to that old broken down talking computer just the way he is. You have a good one, alright? All right, so what's this other mission we got here? Deliver Jake Stout to uh, speak with Rivka. Okay. And she's up top. All right. Let's see what she needs. Let's play mass right now. Hold up. Um. Oh, uh, we're encumbered. Um. Okay. I think we'll go to the ship, drop stuff off. Yeah, because we're losing our weight as well. They're surprisingly sneaky. Hey, you buy Hey, friendo. Got any <coughs> special goods you're willing to part with? Take a look. I want to sell weapons. Um, is it better than the Eon? That one is, but the fire rate sucks on it. Uh, I will sell this one. I will sell this one. And I will sell this one as well. Space suits. I will sell this one. Packs. Skip. Capacity boost pack. What does that mean, I wonder? This one has better protection. Helmets. Apparel, don't care. I'm gonna sell these because they're not worth it. Kinda like how they're not worth it in. I need to read these too, don't I? Yes, I do actually. Same for that one. Resources. I need to store all of this stuff, don't I? Yeah. Well, I will do that for now because that is a lot of weight that I don't want on, on me right now. Be <coughs> safe out there. No, no, I don't want that. Alright, so we're no longer overweight.
Whoever finds this. Oh, is this a possible quest we can get? My name is... I've been drifting with no fuel for over a week now with no signs of rescues. To those I have wronged, I wish I could say I'm sorry, but the truth is, I don't know if it's true. This isn't how I would like to die. Is that a new quest? No, it's not. Okay. Crimson Fleet, this is Delgado. You have all been spreading far and wide across the settled systems, just like we talked about. Do not stop. <coughs> Free Star Collective, United Colonies, they think the galaxy is theirs. They are wrong. It belongs to the free people of the Crimson Fleet. Crimson Fleet, this is the Did I s Okay, hold up. Crimson Fleet. Now we know. This is the Galo. You have all been spreading far and wide across the settled systems, just like we talked about. Do not stop. Free Star Collective, United Colonies, they okay. think the galaxy is theirs. They are wrong. It belongs to the free people of the Crimson Fleet. It always has. We are just reclaiming what is rightfully ours. And we will use their own selfishness and arrogance against them. Those of you old enough to grow hair remember the colony war. Remember those morons fighting and dying over nothing. They built facilities all over. Oh, man. Facilities that are still there, intact and abandoned. Just waiting for someone to come in and set up shop. That someone is the Crimson Fleet. So go! Make yourselves at home and bring the fight right to their goddamn doorsteps! I am going to do a dumb thing. He's not. Yes, I am, honestly. Oh, that was close. I got a little bit of everything. What the heck are those things? You see, Marine Pack. Oh, those are. Um, okay, those are. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. Those are, um, boost packs. Okay, cool. Oh, there's one up there, even. Oh. Dude. We got a lot of good stuff here. Come take a look, eh? The owner caught... Oh, because of that... Okay. Making things harder for yourself. Nah, that's just like, you know. Do that. I'll just leave that one alone. I can't believe you just stole that. I'll just leave that one alone. Oh! Oh! Oh, well, hello! I didn't realize that was there. us out with the equipment and all <coughs> I was wondering if I could talk to you <coughs> it's it's probably <coughs> not but I can't afford to go get it looked bad No idea. Mm. <coughs> Sorry. 
some sort of long rot, maybe from all the Martian dust that <coughs> kicks up in here, or it could be something worse. It's not a matter of money. There's more to it than that. Actually, maybe this is wrong. You're a total stranger. Forget I said anything. Really? That bad? I... Well, it's clear you want to help. Maybe I can trust you. See, I'd like to go to client medical for treatment, but my father, Nathan, is an executive with the Reliant. I came to Sidonia to escape him. Nathan is not a good man. Not to me. And I did something terrible to him, so now he is searching far and wide for me. He has connections with doctors throughout the settled systems. I don't know which ones I can trust, and it won't end well for me if they snitch to him. Mm. After my mother died in an accident, he changed. He became obsessed with my protection, but he never listened to what that was doing to me. It got worse and worse. First, it was no traveling in ships without one of his pilots. Then, no parties, no drinking, no leaving the house. I obeyed. But he didn't trust me, so he started monitoring everything I did. It became so bad, he once locked me in my room for two days after an argument. Can you believe that? A prisoner in my own home. Every That's day bad. there was yelling, lack of freedom, threats. I had to escape my prison. But even now... I am trapped. <coughs> it's a risk I have to take. Yes, my condition is getting worse, but there's a chance it will clear up on its own. If my father finds me, well, I know my father and I fear for my safety. Hmm. That is a definite. It's worse than you think. I didn't just <coughs> run away from him. I knocked him unconscious, then stole his ship while he was out cold. Trust me, it was warranted at the time. After mm -hmm. I dished it above Aquila, I bounced around <coughs> settled systems until I landed here. It's the last place I thought he'd find me. But all that changes if I pop up in the Reliant database. He'll know I'm in Sidonia, and he'll never stop looking for me. Last I heard, he no longer cares for my safety. He only wants revenge. I have little doubt he would throw me in jail for as long as possible. Or worse. <coughs> uh. Trevor tells me you're skilled in dealing with people. Maybe you could try to reason with my father, or maybe scare him into backing off. But, you should know, he has powerful and dangerous friends, so you must be careful. If it works, I'll be free. If not, well, at, at least he still won't know where to find me. <coughs> what do you think? Hmm, the last he one? wasn't always the way he is. It wasn't until... <coughs> After my mother died, that he changed. Grew angry, dangerous. He was no longer himself. You could try mentioning her by name. Belinda. He misses her greatly. Thinking about her tends to calm him down. It's worth a try. I love the different accents they have in this game. It is so wonderful to hear that. Even if, even if the actors are faking the accents, which I'm not saying they are, I'm just saying if they are, it's a breath of fresh air to hear these accents. It's, it's so good. 
Like, it's, yeah, it's wonderful. I'm enjoying this game so much right now. That's why I'm just quiet. It just so happens there's a conference he goes to on Neon around this time of year. He always stays at Hotel Volai. He won't see visitors he doesn't know, but maybe he'll talk if you tell him you're there on my behalf. It's risky, but maybe he'll listen if he knows you mean him no harm. I've got it. Bring him a bottle of his favorite whiskey, Red Harvest Reserve. <coughs> Say it's... <coughs> It's a piece of <coughs> from me. That whiskey is exceedingly rare. I'm sure it will pique his interest enough to hear what you have to say. Hmm. If I do this for you, can you promise whatever happened with him won't happen again? As much as possible, yes. I intend to patch things up with him and work with him on our mutual issues. I believe with therapy we could repair our relationship as damaged as it is. Or if you discover it is irreparable, at least you could put the fear of God in him and that should deter him from taking further action. There may be, but getting him to listen to you is the key here. And what I've told you is the surest way I can think of. There was a time he had a falling out with his brother, and that whiskey did the trick to bring them back together. With that gift, he will know I am sincere. Good luck. You can check with Jack at the Broken Sphere for okay. the whiskey. He may have some or... <coughs> know where to get it. And thank you so much for trying to help me. Cool, okay. A reminder that particle detonations can occur beyond the city limits between the hours of 0600 and 1800 mm -hmm. local time. Nope, nope. I need to go this way. Ugh, ugh, fudge, that was a good one. Ah. Ah. Bummer. <coughs> I could use a break. Excuse me. Got cold beers and good atmosphere. Not much more you could ask for. I am. But you don't look like the type that could afford it. The last person that came through here asking about it was none other than Governor Hurst. Didn't even want to drink it. Said he was buying it to put it on display in his office or something. Seems like a waste, but eh, whatever. He paid up. I can almost guarantee it's more than you think. So, are you sure about that? Money bags. Oh, wow. <laughs> you don't get it. This whiskey was aged in barrels buried in Martian soil, which leached into it, giving the whiskey its distinct red hue. They don't make this stuff anymore and never will. The exact process was lost. There's a finite amount of this stuff left in the universe. <laughs> You're lucky I got any at all. Now you got my attention. This will be good. I love this little mini game. It is so good. How many are there? Two point. Uh, eh. Mouse. Two, four, eight. Oh, joyness. It's compelling. But I'll need no more. I 
I smell bullshit. You do realize it sounds like you're trying to swindle me here, right? <sighs> not happening. Sorry, not buying your story. You want that whiskey? You gotta pay full price. Final offer. Yeah. Well, think about it. I didn't think you were serious. Well, he said that the governor has one on display. All right, so. Governor's office it is then. Where's it saying to go? Hold up. Okay, so the optional one is to steal it. Okay, yeah, we're gonna do that one. We're gonna go pilfer. Not everyone needs to come to me with their problems. A friend offered me a nice cushy office job. We're going to go pilfer this thing. That's it. It's not wanting to fit right. This sucks, but whatever. It is what it is. <coughs> okay, where is the mayor's office? I mean, the governor's office. Oh yeah, it's right, right, right well, well. through. Look what the Martian winds blew in. Well, hi there. Used to think I was Van Gogh material. Oh, joyness. Damn. Okay, I got an idea. Fall in the cracks. Come on out. Fall in the hole. Ah, you're gonna see me, isn't he? Yeah. I need to fall in this hole right here. Eh. Don't see me. Oh. I had it. I had it. No. Come on! Oh, it only does it for like a split moment. Come on! Oh no! Oh, it's not quick enough. Dang it, no.
Oh, I can almost get it. I can almost get it. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. I can almost get it. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I can almost get it. Oh, come on. I can almost taste it. Oh, come on. Oh, no. No. Oh, it's not. I might need a chameleon thing, um, for this one. Cause I don't have it anymore. Cause I got rid of it. Oh no, I had it. Come on, game, give it to me, please. Oh, wait, I wonder. Hold up, I wonder. Oh, hell, 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 hell I wonder. Do you have any clue how irresponsible you're acting right now? Oh, you can't shoot the lights out. I need this. Come on, game. Please. Please. Okay, I got an idea. Hold up. I'm gonna... You may think you're clever with your little blackmail scheme, but if you're not careful, you're going to make powerful enemies. Can you move, lady? Oh, and he sees me again. Yeah, dang it, man. Yeah, I might need something else for this. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. Oh! Lady, you're... I wasn't moving forward, I was moving backwards. Do you have a child or children between the ages of five to eighteen? Enroll them in a united colony. It's moving forward whenever I go backwards. I wanna do this. Oh now he sees me now. No, he doesn't. Hug the wall. 
<laughs> oh, no, please, no. I am not moving forward. I'm moving backwards. James, stop. I can't, I can't get it. How much money, how much money do I have? Uh, money, 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 money. Eh, I guess I'll buy it. I can't get it. I don't have, yeah, I can't get it at all. Uh, I can't get it. I'll have to buy it. Before you say anything, no, and Mars Sam, is fan not of the like Earth. Drama around Heck, here. Even Earth is not the I like do Earth. if you still want to buy it. Here you go. See? Now it doesn't matter whether you're lying or not about needing it so badly. Ow, I my sure money. That well, wasn't so bad. Hearing loss is impermanent. I'm sure I could be persuaded into having a drag. All right, so where is Neon? Unexplored route, huh? Unexplored route, huh? So that's where he is, huh? I want to um, zoom in on it, but I can't. Huh. Weird. Whatever. Um. We have the ale. Deliver. Wait, we need that one, so right. Is this? Is this where we need to get that? I forgot. Hold up. I lived on Mars for an entire year, and I'm convinced I'll never get used to the dusty air. <coughs> Keep it simpler. What's your point? Jack Stout. Okay. Well, I don't see it there. Long. Unless it was a different. Oh, it's Jake's, so not Jack's. Okay. Minor. Let's go ahead and go back somewhere else then. Speak with someone else. Okay. Well. <clears throat> okay, so that's taking us back there. Okay. Um. 
Because we could go back there. Wrong one. But we do have... No. Let's go here. Let's go visit London. Why not? Let's visit London. Actually, we'll, we'll just do this. It's easier. So the course for Earth. Travel to Earth. Traveling to Earth. Solar system. Now where's the moon? I want to find the moon. There's the sun. Must be around somewhere else then, right? Maybe. And there was a war here or something. Good lordy. Wow. This is London. Okay. Captain, hello. I am satisfied to see that you survived your most recent sleep cycle. No oxygen on Earth, really. Minus one degree temperature. Zeroing in on anything useful? I wonder what happened. No. There's another unknown one. Interesting. Water is safe. Thin CO2. No magnetosphere. So Earth is dead dead. Earth is just gone. London landmark. Oh, what office building looks like. London snow globe. Hmm. 
Let's go check out this other natural resource while we're at it. Why not? I really wonder what happened here. Unexplored geophysical feature. Well, I don't see it. Is it in this hole? Yeah, it is. Okay. Oh, it's an iron meteorite. Okay. Do I scan it again? I have to scan it again, but where at? I don't see where I scan it again. Scan it again. It's saying this. I have to scan it a second time, but where? One of two scanned, but. I don't see where I scan it again. Whatever. I'm not gonna mess with it. I'm done. Who cares? I am done with that. It is what it is. Can I go here, I wonder? What up? No, I want to like go here. Yeah. Can I go on the moon? That would be cool. Type rock, huh? Huh. 
Yes, fast travel to here. Warm up the engines. Alright, take off. Let's go somewhere else in... ...on Earth. And explore, because why not? Let's go... Not here. Let's go over to our native land. There's Florida. There's Tejas. Let's go maybe like about here. Is it all a sandy desert, really? It is, wow. What, right here? I really want to know what happened to Earth. Wow, this is just... I can't get up on my ship. Wow, what in the heck happened here? Natural, okay. Wow, what in the world happened to Earth? <laughs> I really want to know. <laughs> Can we go to the moon? I'm curious. Hello. Can we go to the moon? Inventory. Okay, yeah, let's go to resources and Oh no, those weigh a lot. Um, okay, yeah. Alright. Our mass is now, and how much is the ship's mass? Oh, joy. Okay. Take off. Let's see if we can go to the moon or not, and then I'll put a cut in the video. I am still interested to know what happened to Earth in this game. Alright, so where is Luna? Other side of the planet. No, that's not where we're at. We're in Soul System. Set a course for Luna. Land. Planet map. Land on the moon. Let's see what's here. Oh, yeah. We're on the moon. Oh, yeah. I want their stuff here, even. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, 
Oh, there's stuff here. <laughs> Oh, well, this is going to be fun. <laughs> There's stuff here. This is going to be f fun to explore. Oh, man. This is going to be a blast. I am going to put a cut in the video here and we will pick up. Where's my actual safe? Here it is. Yeah, we will pick up with more Starfield on the moon in the next video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did. This game, I'm having fun with it. But yeah, anyways, if you guys are having fun with this game, feel free to subscribe, like, and hit the bell for more. It will help my channel grow, and you guys will get notif notifications whenever I post new videos. I post videos every day. Sometimes I will not post multiple videos a day, but for the most part, I do. Anyways, have a good day, guys, and I will see you guys later.